so we're out now in a Freelander TD4 XS. The XS is not bottom of the range and not top of the range, it's a really nice middle of the road specification. So you get navigation, you get cruise control, you get climate control with heated seats. The only thing you don't tend to get above this as an HSE is a sunroof and full leather. Well in this weather, these cloth inserts into the middle of the seats make it really very pleasant. It's uh, not cold in the winter and it's not hot in the summer. This is the Tiptronic automatic version with hill descent and all the other four-wheel drive assist capabilities. So it sits on the road like a really nice, solid, well put together car. But should you need to go off-road with it, again, very capable in most circumstances. I'm just going to have a walk around now. The 59 registration Freelander XS, finished in silver. 2.2 diesel, manual six-speed. Very straight level car. Again, private use, not been off-roading. Wind deflectors fitted, which are the original Land Rover fitment. Look inside the car. The car is in lovely condition. Excess comes with the half leather interior so you don't burn your bum in the sun and you don't uh, freeze your backside in the winter. Very nicely kept. No evidence of anything being marked or chewed from animals. Single electric tow bar, Put something up for £10,000. You can get yourself into a four wheel drive Freelander XS 2.2 diesel. Car's in lovely condition, comes warranted, PDI'd, and looked after by ourselves prior to the collection. Give myself a call and see if we can do a deal with a part exchange or find you a suitable finance package.